this term being thrown around too loosely, and I'm quite sick of hearing it, man. I'm tired of all of these chicks calling themselves queens, and they don't even love themselves. I'm an 80s baby, man. All my crushes growing up were real women. Natural beauties, real titties, real ass, real face. Everything about them was gorgeous, even their attitudes, everything, man. Nowadays, all these chicks want to call themselves queens. Self-proclaimed, ain't earned no title. And y'all call them queens too. Y'all respect that shit. It's nice to look at. Nice to have sex with. But to wife that up? Hell no, I'm good. All of these bozo ass niggas be wifing these chicks up. Because they wasn't getting no chicks when they was growing up. They don't even know what the standard of a beautiful woman is. Nowadays, the standard is being fake. Being fake is the new real. And y'all respect that? Y'all call them queens? They ain't no fucking queens. They don't even love themselves. Bring the natural women back, the real women. You know, at first, I kind of felt where he was coming from. I did, because I'd be the first to tell you, I love natural women too. I, I think natural is beautiful, you know? I, I constantly praise those women that's working with what God gave them, especially in a world that tries to make women fit into this specific mold and don't look like what a lot of women got blessed with naturally. I'm all for that, but... He lost me at a couple of detours and ended up in the city of bullshit. When he started making this personal, romantic, or sexual, or wifeable preference, the measurement of a woman in whole, as real or fake, or as a queen or not a queen, because we don't do that shit for men. We don't do that shit for men. For these dudes out here that have replaced all their teeth with, with gold fronts, we don't, do, we don't say they ain't no king. All these dudes out here with tatted up hairlines now, we don't say, oh, you don't love yourself because you ain't got the hairline that God blessed you with. We, we don't say they ain't no king. And I'm not saying you can't have your romantic preference, whatever. Women like tall dudes, short dudes, buff dudes, dudes with beards. Men are allowed to as well. But that ain't no measurement of a king or queen. But I do agree with him on one part. When he said that the term queen is used a little loosely these days, I agree with him on that. Although the way that he's using it, it ain't just loose. It didn't fell the fuck apart. But a king or a queen is somebody who's a role model based on their character. Based on their character, not on how they look. Somebody that if there was more people like that person, the world would be a better place. Not a better place to find somebody to fuck. Not a better place to find somebody to wife. A better place to live in. But sidebar, if we're going to have this conversation about a woman that we want a wife versus a woman that we just want to fuck, let's have it, honestly. Let's ha let's keep it G. Truth is, most of these dudes out here ain't trying to wife nobody. And there's plenty of natural girls walking around. Why? Because we too busy still trying to fuck with the girls that we say ain't wifeable. Or we will wife that wifey type. We will wife that natural girl. And we'll break a heart. Or we'll lose her because we're trying to fuck on the girls that we say ain't wifeable. So how valuable is the wifey type really? Beyond the, the, the Instagram memes and videos and repost and share. Like that shit is cool. The captions is cool. But our actions say we don't really give a fuck about the wifey type. We giving all our attention to the rest of the girls. If we really going to keep it G and have this conversation. But back to what I was saying, man. Whether or not a woman is a queen... Ain't got shit to do with her physical. And I'm not one of those people that say every woman is a queen. I don't believe that. Every man ain't no king. Every woman ain't no queen. If we strictly speak into the topic of women, these deadbeat and, and toxic moms that's ruining these kids, that ain't no queen. Scammer chicks, that ain't no queen. These girls that's trying to fuck on their girls, a uh, man or husband, that ain't no queen. A girl that's in a relationship with a dude, hardworking, he a good guy. But she secretly want her ex, so she constantly belittling her man because she never got over her ex guy. That ain't no queen. But it ain't got nothing to do with where she get her ass and titties from. And real kings know this.